Hi there, my name is Ryan Townsend and I'm in Economic Geography 360. And when asked to think of what economy is to me, I think of economy as the way in which resources are managed and organized. These resources can be actual currency, or they can be other things like the raw materials, refined products, or even the labor process itself. An economy is able to thrive and be successful if the people existing within it are able to efficiently manage the various activities by which these resources are exchanged. Activities such as the manufacturing of the product, the sale and distribution of the product, and even how the product are used is all different ways that these levels exist within an economy. These different levels of the economy are broken down into what economists call sectors. And today, most agree on three main sectors of the economy, the primary, secondary, and tertiary levels. The primary sector deals with how raw materials like coal or oil are extracted from the earth, while the second sector deals in the way in which these raw materials are transformed into products that people can actually use. Finally, the tertiary sector focuses on the service industry, for example, how these products are sold or distributed to other people. Um, let's see. Of course, these economies do not exist within an isolated bubble, and they are subjected to external forces that are outside of these three sectors, such as natural disasters, the physical geography of a place, or war. Specifically, the impact and importance of the geographical factors can be seen simply in the fact that so many different economies exist all over the world and each have similar and different ways in which their resources are managed.